Hi everyone, thank you for joining us today for our hashtag Get Fit Anywhere SG program. Before we get on to the strength exercise today, I would like to share with you that this program is a part of Get Active Singapore, where we celebrate a stronger Singapore through sport. So let's go. Hello everyone, my name is Dr. Ong. I'm a sports medicine doctor from Kutepot Hospital. So today the exercise we're going to talk about is hip raises. This exercise targets your gluteus muscles, your hamstring muscles in your lower body, as well as your core muscles. It improves the strength of these muscles as well as contributes to overall pelvic stability. Uh, in terms of rural transfer, this exercise is extremely useful for correcting posture relating to pelvic tilt. And it's also an exercise that is often used in the rehabilitation for back and leg injuries. So now I hand over the session to Coach Bernie, who will tell you more about the exercise. Hi everyone, I am Bernie from Fuel Fit, and today I'll be showing you how to perform a hip raise. Start by lying down, flat on your back, with your knees bent and your feet flat on the ground. From here, what you want to do is to tilt your pelvis such that your lower back is in contact with the ground. Maintaining this position, lift your hips up, squeeze your bum, and slowly come down in a controlled motion. One more time, I'm going to lift my hips up, pushing through my feet in an even manner, and coming back down again. While you're doing this exercise, things to take note of is that you don't want to be doing it in a jerky motion. Remember that this exercise is all about control. So these are the actions that you should not do. Okay, so you notice that I've actually jerked my hips up and then dropped my hips down back onto the ground. That is dangerous because it might cause injury to your lower back or your tailbone. Another thing to take note of is you want to have even pressure through your feet and not on your tiptoes. So things to avoid is lifting your hips up like this with your heels off the ground. So these are just some of the things to take note of. Perform 8 to 12 repetitions for a total of 3 sets. If you found that too easy, what you can do is to do the single leg hip raise instead. Let me show you how to do it. So lying down flat on the ground. From here, lift one leg up. Remember what you want to do is to tilt your pelvis such that your lower back is in contact with the ground. From here, pushing through my whole foot, I'm lifting my hips up, squeeze my bum, and coming back down. One more time. Up. And coming back down again. Remember that after performing 8 to 12 repetitions on one leg, you switch over and repeat 8 to 12 repetitions on the other leg as well for a total of three sets. And this is the hip raise. 